Hi, Leo. This is for all the Leo singles. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Okay? Um, if you are new to my channel, I'm Sam, and welcome. If you could please subscribe, hit like, and share. Um, that way you will continue to get notifications of all the readings that I post, but also help my channel grow. And by leaving a message or subscribing and being part of my um, channel, I can pick up on your energy when I do the readings, make it a little bit more personal for you. Okay, and this is going to be for all Leos who are single, maybe recently separated from someone, um, completely single that you don't even have any, maybe attraction to anyone or anyone in mind, just questioning when it's going to come towards you. Maybe you're just dating someone and not exclusive, but we'll see what comes through for Leo. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. All of my Leo singles. What message do you have for them, Spirit? What message do you have for them? Thank you. Recovery. So probably most of you that are single are just taking time out rest and relaxation for yourself doing things for yourself which is always a good idea that way when it does happen for you you're um you're grounded you know you just you become stronger when you take care of yourself Just because it's going to be different for everyone. Message for Leo singles. Sun, moon, rising, and Venus. Let go of control issues. Allow the situation to unfold naturally. I feel like a lot of Leos are leaders. And they do. They try to... Um, they just... They do. They try to make plans. They try to be in control of everything in their life. Not many Leos like to be surprised. Which isn't a bad thing. Okay. Release your ex. This time, the time has come to clear your energy. So guys... Maybe you're single because something from your past has broken your heart. And dating is always such an, you know, dating can be fun, but it takes effort. And maybe releasing your ex, you just haven't jumped back into it yet. Of getting to know someone else. I really feel like you're just focusing on yourself right now. But we'll see what's coming in. The first card is going to be the readiness of you being willing to meet someone. What is Leo's energy towards wanting to meet someone? You do want it. Could be somebody from your work that you're interested in. Maybe school. Maybe a project that um, you and another person are working on. But your wish fulfillment's coming soon, Leo. What are, for the person coming towards you, Leo, what are some of their characteristics? Some of the characteristics of the person coming towards me. Could 
could be a younger earth sign. They could be brunette, masculine or feminine. But I believe for now, they're working on being abundant within themselves. They might have started something new, maybe a brand new job, um, something that's going to make them grounded and stable. They might be going through a spiritual awakening. They're basically standing on the lotus flower. This is at the bottom. Could be a fire sign. But it's like they've been through struggles and they rose above them. Yeah, they just like I said. But they still have love to give. What's another characteristic of Leo's next person? Thank you, Spirit. Yeah, you guys have, this person that's coming towards you has been through, they've had their own burdens to withstand. Looks like the same person. But they're doing it. They have their balance and they're working on their pentacles. This person is going to be a part of your destiny with the Wheel of Fortune at the bottom. How is Leo meeting this person? Four of Swords popped out in reverse. So this is like a card of rest of relaxation when it's in the upright. You know, going within, getting clarity on your thoughts. Four of Swords is doing things that aren't causing rest and relaxation. So you might be going out with your friends, being out in a social environment, seeing them when you least expect it. How is Leo meeting this person? Thank you, Spirit. Seven of Swords. It might be for somebody that's caused you heartbreak that you meet this person. Maybe a friend that is giving you um, the support to get through the pain that you've been through. The Seven of Swords, you know, is defiance, um, lies, deceit. Pay attention to feathers, Leo's. But there might be a pain that you've been through that they're offering support. They might contact you on the internet. They might keep track of you on the internet with the Page of Swords here. They might see you go through an ending. Yeah. They might see you going through pain, going through an ending currently or maybe in the near future. And they're going to communicate with you. I really do believe it's going to be over the internet. One more card for how you're going to come in contact with this person, please. Thank you. King of Pentacles. Okay. This person is def definitely going to be grounded when they make their offer, the person that's coming towards you. Whether it's just a union, when you see this person, the two of you start to conversate. But I really feel like through a broken heart, they come into your life. It could be somebody from your, your place of employment. They might have a dog. But I really feel like somebody caused you pain and they might even be socializing with you over the internet, offering you advice and comfort through 
postings that you might be placed that you might be placing on social media but it's like they have this deep knowing that they could have the ten of cups with you they have like this gut feeling that you and them would be completely happy together or if the relationship characteristics could it be Yeah, like I said, it's going to come together after an ending of something. There's going to be an ending to something else. And I really believe it's you, Leo. You might currently be with someone and it's just not making you happy. It's like you might be seeing this person and also wanting to come together with this person. But their characteristics, they definitely have had burdens that they've had to go through and become abundant and stable on their own. And I believe the two of you are going to start conversating because they're going to offer you support through a breakup. But I believe it's going to be through the internet first. Can I have anything else for characteristics of this relationship? Yeah, here's the movement. There's going to be an ending and a decision made. It's going to cause this to move to the next level. What is going to be the overall outcome of this? Five of Wands. There's going to be struggles at first. It could be two of the same sex with this rainbow here. There's two women and children. Doesn't have to be though. It's whatever re you resonate with in this reading. Yeah, but there's a strong knowing that the two of you, look at this, the Hierophant, the High Priestess and the Ten of Cups. There's gonna be struggles though in the beginning. And I, I think if Leo, you're currently just coming out of something and they are, you know, you may not realize it in the beginning. That way, that might be what the struggle is. Yeah, there's the sun card. I was going to say, but there's going to be happiness. Yeah. There's going to be like that brand new idea, that aha moment. It's going to feel like wish fulfillment. When you realize that this person has feelings for you. The Queen of Cups. The devil here. It could be like, you know, some people, some readers think that the um, devil card is twin flame union just because of that unbreakable bond, that unbreakable connection. It could be, it could lead to that for some of you. Angels, spirit guides, anything else for Leo in this connection? Anything else for Leo in this connection? Yeah, there's this is gonna take place through sadness. If this union is gonna come together after you felt sadness for something else, Leo. So yeah, and this is this is spirit definitely saying you are the one who's going to suffer a breakup. If it hasn't happened already, if you are like just currently maybe dating somebody um, and it's not exclusive, that might be an ending that's coming. It might it might cause you some pain, even though it wasn't exclusive. But I think it's something you haven't moved on maybe to another person and you're just remaining single because of the sadness that you felt at one point. But the readiness is for you to want to be with someone and work on something with someone. And they've also had their struggles. I'm going to get clarity with another deck.
Anyways, let me know how this resonates. I'm excited. I really feel like if you are suffering any pain from something that didn't work out, I do let me know because I will send you healing energy. But at that point, I think somebody, you might be putting sad posts or just there might be a vibe that people are catching up on that you're going through, you know, and ending and getting regrouping and getting yourself together. And I th think through support, it may be an earth sign. Um, through the things that somebody else has caused you pain from, this person's going to come forward. That's when the decision's being made of them to take action towards you. And the sun is here, Leo. You're showing up in your own reading. The sun is going to shine at the end. Please clarify. Yeah, it's good. King of Pentacles twice. Why is the King of Pentacles here twice? Thank you, Spirit. Yeah, they're the ones that are going to take the leap of faith towards you. I think this person has definitely worked on their finances. They've leveled up with their finances. They could be a boss. Could have their own business. Caution, Leo. They might come off a little cocky when they're, you know, just start conversating with you because they are a king of pentacles, but there's always more. There's That's their surface. Give them a chance. Can you clarify the Ten of Wands and the Page of Pentacles as their person's characteristics? Page of Wands. Yeah, there it's definitely might be a younger sign than you are. Fire or um, earth. But it's like they've learned to become grounded through their struggles also. Please clarify their meaning. Please clarify how their meaning is going to take place. Oh. They might gift you something. They might... <laughs> There's going to be this equal give and take now through some pain that you've been through. But they might gift you something. They might see you hurting and send you something. You know, like they might reach out to you and say, I've seen that you're hurting, Leo, and or that you've been through a breakup and, you know, that you're single. And I'd like to send you something. It could be over the internet because, you, you know, you can give gifts over that. I really think they're going to take the leap of faith. And can you please clarify the characteristics of this relationship? Yeah, guys. It's through pain that this comes together. It might be a friend. It might be an acquaintance, a situation that you you were around this person at points of your life. Maybe they hung out in the same group. Like I said, you might have gone to school with them. Can you please clarify the overall outcome for Leo? All right, two flipped out. The chariot and the moon again. Pay attention to your dreams. Spirit might be giving you signs that this person is, you know, right around the corner and they're coming in quickly. But there is going to be movement. There are things hidden. And I believe it's this person's feelings for right now. Spirit, why is the chariot here twice? Why is that showing up here twice? Look at this, guys. This is why 
this person is coming towards you. It's going to be in a manner that you're not used to. And look at this. This is why the chariot's here twice. This union is coming together. I love this for you, Leo. Let me get just a few more cards. I really wanted this to be it. And, you know, not so long reading. Anything else for Leo and the person that's coming towards them? The hammer. Sabotage, rebuilding, persistent, working on it, and love call. Someone expresses love, a message of love, thinking of you and letting you know. I love when spirit comes through, clarifies what I said. Anything else for Leo and their person? Okay, thank you, spirit. Addiction, codependent, obsession, possession, controlling, has a block. Guys, that's what I think that you were going through the relationship in the past. The reason that you couldn't, you know, you just couldn't let go of control. You couldn't let go maybe of the past. You might have are currently healing from it. But this person is going to be not too far behind. Anything else for me? I want a person. The next person that comes towards the end. Communications at the bottom. Pay attention to threes. Repeating threes. Skype, sudden, unexpected, shock, surprise. That's what the fool is. They're going to come rushing in when you least expect it. Letter, writing, communication, fax, email, mail. So for some of you, it might be a phone call. For others of you, it could be a, a, a letter, you know, in this day, I don't know. Maybe a letter, maybe a card. Definitely most of you an email and look at this new beginnings desire and then tree it's going to come in and it's going to be grounded you might even for those of you who are interested in this you may even have a child together or you may have children and this person might have children sudden increase in number but it's going to be grounded and it's going to be healthy. All right, Leo. So this is your singles reading. And this rocks. I love this reading for you guys. Let me know how it resonates. Um, I just began doing these for all the singles. So, you know, just give me a little bit of time. And then you'll be able to check your rising and moon sign and Venus. But the next, next person coming in, they're going to see either in person they see you going through a breakup, a recent breakup, healing from something, just being single and doing things for yourself after something that ended with someone. And that's when they're going to come in. And I believe they're going to act like they're showing you support, which happens a lot through social media. But that, that one email, that one communication it's going to be from somebody grounded. Like I said, could be a king of pentacles, an earth sign, or a fire sign. But once they make that decision to come rushing in, it's going to be that warm energy that fills your heart again. All right, Leo. Love and light. I will be back for many readings. So if you are new, please subscribe, hit like, and share. And stay safe. Be back soon.